Hey guys, and welcome to my new LP, Let's Play Dark Cloud. Oh, sorry about this. Took, this took so long to set up and stuff. I mean, even trying to get all this stuff working was a bit of a pain. But anyway, um, yes, this is my uh, new. This is done on my new Diamond Multimedia BC500 One Touch Video Capture Card. It's pretty damn good, I must say, from what I've seen so far. It's got fairly good quality. Unfortunately, I haven't worked out how to um, uh, be able to play on my TV and my laptop at the same time. I bought a uh, SCART thingy, but that just doesn't seem to have worked, so never mind. Anyway, this is, is Dark Cloud, like I said. Uh, it's PlayStation 2. Um, as you probably saw. It is uh, 2001, I think. Yeah, it's quite an old game. Um, but it's like one of my favourite RPGs for the uh, for the PlayStation 2. Um, I was considering doing a PS1 game. Uh, what games have I got with me? I've got Croc, uh, which is Legend of the Gobbos, <laughs> Final Fantasy IX, Heart of Darkness, and Spire of the Dragon. I've got those games with me. Those are like my uh, PS1 games. Then I've got like a whole list of PS2 games. But I thought I would do um, Dark Cloud out of all of them because I. It's not it's not hugely popular, or at least it hasn't been not many people I know have actually heard of it, so I don't know. That's why I kind of picked it. I kind of thought I'd pick something a bit a bit more interesting. Hope I think hopefully enough of you have seen it, so well, have played it, seen it, whatever. Know of it, whatever. Um so you have some sort of knowledge of the game. That's that's what I'm going for. Um but the idea is that hopefully it hasn't been LP'd too much. I haven't really looked into that. I didn't really want to look into it in case it has been LP'd loads. But it can't be as bad as like starting Ocarina of Time when that's probably the most LP'd game on YouTube. Anyway. So what have we got? We want vibration on. I don't know why I don't have that on. Uh, I want the clock on, of course. Sound is, is stereo. Yes, I'm playing through both sounds here. Um... Message display speedy. I, don't, I want it on normal for now. Time progress. You want it on normal at first. That be becomes more obvious later. So this is all set set up pretty well. So um, that's a little. Might as well begin. Uh, I'm going to try and read out this beginning bit to you. But uh, yeah, a book was found in some old ruins. All the scholars who decoded it puzzled over the mystery of the book. A world with two moons illuminating the sky. The many dazzling adventures of a young boy. But whether or not this is a true story. Do you believe in the story woven in the book? Maybe it's a fantasy that existed only in a boy's heart. Let me tell you this story this ancient book tells of. And magical. Yeah. And magnificent fairy tale. And the hero of this wondrous tale, whose name is... Hmm. I'm wondering what I should call him. Tone is like... or Tone, whatever, I don't know. I think it's Tone. I don't know. Well, well, I've called him some weird things over the years. But it's just kind of... Yeah, I know. I know, I know, I know. I will call... Oops. Still trying to get used to the slight delay. I tried not to pick anything quite too. Uh, oops. Um, quite too. Thingy me jiggy. Dark shrine. So we got a ran random bunch of crazy dancers and a woman who's trying to break her neck. I'm pretty sure doing that is really bad for your neck, but whatever. I'm not one to pass judgement on weirdos. I've gathered quite a few of them. I had a hard time finding dancers with the right qualifications. Look at them. They dance of blood. 
mix in the blood of witches with that of humans is the key to breaking the seal. However, I do have some problems. Problems. In order to procure good material, you do need adequate. I see. I'll pay you back for that or something. Oh shit. Yes, sir. Thank you. So when will it happen? Very soon, sir. Enjoy the ceremony until it is time. That's going to be his voice from now on. Really weird. Slightly camp, slightly disturbed. I don't know. It just kind of popped into my head, damn it. So they're just going to keep doing their dance. And she's dressed really skimpily. That's like the, the wiggle. Yeah, arse wiggling. Love it. I decided to give uh, that guy with the blue hair. I uh, decided to give him the uh, American accent, a bit like Snake. Make him sound like Salt Snake Archon, etc. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I haven't practiced that impression very much. There's only one line I can really say as Snake, and that's Archon. Samus took her suit off. If you've uh, ever seen Smash Kingdom, that makes a hell of a lot more sense. Hi, how are you today? James, it's already started. Come on, let's go. James, it's already started. Come on, let's go. I don't know if it says that twice. See, I, sh I told you. You should have hurried. Come on, we're late. I'm a staff member this year, so I have to go. Sorry. 
Oh, she left you. <laughs> How brutal. James, hurry up. <laughs> I took a long time to say that. Just for ironic humor's sake. So now he hurries up and puts his face in the bowl and doesn't leave a single mark on his face. I, t I tell you, that boy has talent. I envy him. So now we got the uh, segment with the badass music, which you only get to hear once in the game. And there seems a festival of kinds is going on. They're dancing around the big old flame in the middle. Fair enough. Let's see if I can. Uh, there's a couple of characters here I recognise. That one there, for instance, I know her. It's a strong black man and a ridiculously obese. Fat guy. <laughs> the guy playing a flute and an old man playing a lute. If anybody makes a comment about her being hot, I will slap you. So here we go, we're running across a bridge. You refer to him as me for now, I think. Try to make it more personal. So it's tubby up in the air. Look at the insect squirming about. Start there. <laughs> Fair enough. So you can now shoot lasers from ridiculous places, including his belly. One from his thigh, apparently. That one for him. Now. His forehead. Finger. Oh, that's fair enough, though. Finger, belly button again. Boom, 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 boom. Run, 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 run. It was like, no, <laughs> And then Fatty decided to land on them. Carrying the... I don't know what he was. A general or something? And he was just looking down at the ground. It's like, wow. Skills. <sighs> I guess this is purgatory? Hmm, apparently there's grass in purgatory. And people said to say hi there. Can you hear me? Open your eyes. Wake up! Hey! I don't know. I can do that man voice, but that would just sound so weird. <laughs> I'll try it for just a little bit, see how it goes. <laughs> I'm very... No, see, it's ridiculous. I'm the entity that unites all of nature's spirit. Listen well, young one. Something bad has happened. Men blinded by greed have revived the dark genie. This dark genie is terribly powerful. Its power is so great that it can destroy the entire world. You saw it. Your own village being destroyed right before your eyes. Not just your village. In a flash, many villages and towns were destroyed. In one night, half your world was annihilated. It must be the men from the east that performed the resurrection ceremony. Probably thinking to use black demon power for war, without realizing how frightening it is. It is darkness, pure darkness itself. Long ago, this so called dark genie almost destroyed the entire world. Its malevolence is that great. The bad thing that it has the, the bad thing is that it has the same type of magical power as our spirits. Unfortunately, we aren't powerful enough to destroy it. Young man, I see that you have a strong will that could withstand the evil power, and also a clear, kind heart. You might be able to fight against the darkness that it generates. I decided to stake our fate on you. Let me bless you with power. So I got a cool sapphire on my glove. Big deal. <laughs> Damn right I'm surprised. That's called an Atlamelia. Not Atlamelia. It's a stone with magical power. Oh, don't look that way, boy. I'll explain now. Something about... I can't remember. I 
I skipped it. I'm an idiot. Foolish boy is foolish. Do you know where this is? Oh, this is no simple empty lot. This was your village. But do not lose heart. As long as you have that stone, you can return it to its original form. You see, just before the village was destroyed by the genie, I saved the buildings and people by sealing into spheres called Atla. It seems those Atla were scattered all around by its tremendous magic. They were probably blown to different places around the world. Yeah, the fuck! It probably thinks everything is destroyed. You must restore the world before it realizes what happened. Absorb that which while I sealed in the Atla. Use the Atla, using that Atla Melia and bring them back. Ugh. Then you'll be able to restore the world to its original form. Maybe you've been able to create a better world than before. Give you another lesson when you call us a mantler. So you scratch your head and like, uh, what the fuck sort of gesture. Oh man. I think I cut my finger. This is more of that epic music you should not hear ever again. How it is with life, you say you meet lots of people and you say goodbye to lots of people. Uh, okay, looking for clues, looking for clues. My adventure will begin. And if you talk to the village chief, he'll show me where to go next. Brilliant. So I am in Nolan Village. Uh, in the American version, it is Norun Village, and that's to do with uh, translation problems. See in Japan, L and R. Or I think, I don't think L exists or something. So I guess this is the village chief. I'm just going to get this bit done with him before I uh, stop. So yeah. Do, 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 do. Hmm. No man smoking a pipe. Ah, James, you are alive. Seems like we're the only ones in the village that survived. We never dreamt this. One night and our village is gone. Can you believe this, James? I feel so hopeless. I, the mayor of the village, can't do anything about it. What am I supposed to do now? No idea, mate. <laughs> I guess the only thing we can do is to get help from the guardian of Nolan Village, Dran. Dran will not abandon us. He'll help us, for sure. I have a favour to ask, James. Go to Divine Beast Cave and tell Dran what happened. Divine Beast Cave is the cave outside towards your right hand side. You've probably seen it before. No shit, I've lived in this village for what, 15 years? Don't be such a fucking idiot. Sorry. Continue. I may be imagining things, but I sense something has changed about the cave. Be careful. Hmm. This is the cave key. Nice. I put the things you might need in your bag for you. Don't get carried away. If you get in trouble in there, come back here. I'll get you more supplies. Good luck. Brilliant. So we're going to stop here and then open this, open and a spiky bug is coming out. A prickly, huh? So what the hell am I going to do with a prickly? Oh, this is your item screen. Uh, I will go through this in more detail in the next episode and point out everything to you. Um, this prickly is painful looking fishing bait. So it's fishing bait? Okay, well at least that's a clue that you can go fishing on this game. And I suppose for those of you who have played it, yes, you all know what I mean by fishing being a pain in the arse, but it's something worth doing later on. But anyway, for now, I'm just going to check around in here because there's sometimes stuff in here at this point in the game. Very well. And just 
to go through the saving process with you. Just so you move. Save. And, would you look at that? As many new files as we can cope with. So, this is going to be, because it's creating dark and unsafe file memory, it's going to take a while to save. So, uh, let me just come off the screen a second. Brilliant. Okay, so next time on Dark Cloud, we will really get into the uh, guts of the game and uh, get a little bit closer to working out what the hell is going on here. Anyway, I will see you all then. I hope you uh, enjoyed this first episode. I know I'm going to enjoy the rest of them. So I will see you then.